good day, how to do it fast, because we there's a whole Wait, show. Shh, don't say good day. Good day, how's it? Good day, how's it going? I'm Bob McKenzie. And this is my brother Doug. How's it going? Nate? We got a real good show for you, and like we don't have a lot of time because it's like a, a real big topic. Okay. Okay. Today go. the topic is like oh, uh, micro microwave ovens. Okay. <laughs> okay. Like first of all. First thing to know about microwave oven is never put a cat in because they blow up, eh? Oh, okay, right. like, okay. The topic is like whether you should cook uh, back bacon in a microwave or like this. Well, we know which way to cook it, right? Okay. This way, okay? Where do you plug a back uh, uh, bacon oven, microwave oven? Sorry. A back bacon oven. Okay, I'm slowing down the show, eh? Go ahead. Where? Oh, sorry, everyone. Well, now, like, I don't I'll feel forget. well. I forget. Wait, uh, you never put a back bacon in a microwave oven because, like, if you do... It'll blow up, right? Yeah. Right. No, cats. Back bacon's okay as long as you don't, don't put it yeah, in foil. Foil will but burn. But it's better fried. But don't put in bread. Bread goes soggy, eh? We put in this bread, and look, it's... Well, this, is, this isn't the one. It was this bread. Yeah, this bread went soggy. Okay, and, and like, never put a beer... put the bread, the wrong bread on top. You embarrass me in front of everybody. Okay, and never put a beer Sorry, in the microwave because it'll boil. Okay, that's the show for today. So, good day. Hope you learned a lot about microwaves. The show's over. Oh, boy. You, you know? shouldn't have put the hard bread on top. It completely blew it. Yeah, me. well, I'm supposed to say how bread is soggy. Eh? Look at this. You can stand it up, eh? It's like not soggy at all. Listen look. to that clump. Feel how oh, hard oh, it is. Oh, oh, oh. Feel hard, hmm. eh? Come on, eh? This is hard bread. Yeah, look, it's not going to dent that head of yours. Yeah, it didn't leave much of a scar in your noggin either.